What's going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today, guys, we're going to be unboxing and reviewing this Elite 101 Cody Rhodes. Taking a look at the packaging, you do have Elite Collection logo and the Series 101 logo up there at the top. There's the big WWE logo there. There's the viewing window for you to see the figure and all of its accessories. Taking a look at the bottom, there's Cody Rhodes and the nameplate, which Mattel misspelled. The American Nightmare Cody Rhodes. This figure does come with True FX uh, lifelike details on the head scan. Taking a look at the side of the packaging, it's pretty much normal. You got the Series 101 logo there, the Elite Collection, the name tag. Taking a look at the other side of the packaging, you do have the big WWE logo as well as Cody Rhodes. And at the bottom, you have the Elite Collection logo as well as Series 101. Taking a look at the bottom of the packaging, you do have the little safety requirements read up there with the barcode. And the back of the packaging, it says the American Nightmare Cody Rhodes Elite Collection. There's a little read up about where he's from, a little bit about him. There is a shot of Cody Rhodes himself. And taking a look at the bottom of the packaging, there is a little read up about his career, his career highlights as well as all the people in Series 101. So without further ado, guys, we're going to crack this figure and its accessories out of the packaging and see what they're all about. Taking a look now at these action figure accessories that come with the Elite 101 Cody Rhodes action figure. The first set of interchangeable hands are the open hands. Of course, you do have just the plain skin tone hand there. As well as on this hand, you do have the white wrist tape there going all throughout the palm and the back side of the hand. So there is one set of interchangeable hands. The next set of interchangeable hands is the fisted hands. Of course, you do have the solid hand there. And of course, you have the wrist tape hand with the wrist tape going all throughout uh, the fist there with only a part of his fingers showing uh, the skin tone. And then it comes with an extra pair that's on the figure, which we'll get to in a moment. And then the last action figure accessory that it comes with is his weight belt that says Nightmare. Of course, um, I do believe this is the same um, mold that they used for um, Hollywood Hulk Hogan, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, it's similar to the one that they use for Hollywood Hulk Hogan, but you have Nightmare in kind of, I think it's a black. Yeah, it's more of a black color. It kind of shows up blue on the camera, or on my side at least. But it's black with the logo, the Cody Rhodes logo there. And if you look all throughout the belt, you do have some stitching that looks like uh, looks like stitching there. Turning it over, there's the back side. Of course, you do have the holes and um, the little studs there. Just like you would put on uh, on a figure uh, if it was like a championship belt. So, pretty simple there. Uh, that's pretty much it for all of the accessories. Now, let's hop into the figure. Taking a look now at the Cody Rhodes action figure, the first thing that you'll notice is the head scan of course uh, we are uh, getting a head scan with the true fx technology uh, there is the cody rhodes head scan with the blonde hair of course on this side you do have the neck tattoo there looking really good with the blue and the red moving down you do have the torso i'm not for sure which torso they used on this figure uh, but as you can see it does say dream there on the chest, of course, uh, nothing really special about the back. Double jointed elbows. We're getting down to the hands. There's the normal skin tone hand. And then on this side, you do have the wrist tape and hand tape that goes around the fist. Moving to the gear, uh, you do have an all blue style pants with gold uh, trim coming all throughout the, the pants there with some red, um, like almost like a dragon scale. Um, having a hard time getting this camera to focus. Let's see if that'll make it any better. Like a red maroon type um, decaling there. You got the gold. 
it kind of looks, I'm not for sure exactly what that is, but it kind of looks like a ladder. You have white and gold with gold studding on the white. And then you have black going crossways. Uh, the dragon scaling there on the hips. And then this type of uh, decal there. Moving to the back, of course, you do have the all blue again there on the back. Uh, you got the darker blue up toward the top of the pants. Almost looks like a belt or like a, there's a color change in the pants. Maybe, actually, I think there is some dra uh, dragon scaling uh, or at least it looks like a dragon. Of course, on the front, you do have the big logo and then you have that design on both sides of the pants. Moving down, you do have that scaling again there on the knee pads as well as that. I think it's, uh, I'm not for sure if that's an eagle or what kind of bird that is, but some kind of decal there on the knees. And then we get down into the boots. Cody Rhodes, he just wears, well, I don't know what he wears now. I haven't watched an episode in a couple couple weeks. But uh, at the time of when they made this figure, he was wearing the solid white boots with his logo on the sides. And this looks really good. I really like that logo. You, you get the red, the white, and the blue on that logo. So that looks really good for a Cody Rhodes action figure that's pretty much it for the elite 101 um, action figure i do have one um like one issue with the figure i will go ahead and show you and it is that the boot cut is cut kind of diagonal it's kind of it's kind of cut funny and the figure wants to wobble like it doesn't hardly want to stand up and that's because on both sides of the boot cut it is kind of messed up. As you can see there, it is over on this side to the right too far, and it's over to the left too far on this um, on this side. So that is the only complaint that I have with this Cody Rhodes action figure. Other than that, uh, I am satisfied with this Elite 101 um, Cody Rhodes action figure, but... That's pretty much it, guys, for the video. Hope you guys did enjoy. This has been the review on the Series 101, Cody Rhodes, The American Nightmare. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to hit that like button, guys. Hit that subscribe button, and we'll see you guys on the next one.